We're going to do some breathing, so put your plants safely on the ground. And then sit up with good posture. I need your chairs. And do we remember, Mr. Miller talked a lot last Thursday about breathing. Do we breathe with our chest or our stomachs? Your stomachs. What kind of thing do we want, do you want it to be? Or do you want it to be out or in? You want it to grow, yeah, good. And then when we have good breast support and we have a good airstream, do you know what some good qualities are of a good airstream? Do we want it to be smooth or do we want it to be bumpy? Do we want it to be... Or... A or B? A. Good. Do we want it to be constant or do we want it to stop short? So do we want it to be... Or... A or B? A, good, good. All right, so let's sit up straight. And we're going to breathe in, and then we're going to breathe out sizzle. Do you know what sizzle is? Yes. Yeah, good. So we're going to breathe in for four and out for eight. All right. One, two, three. Again, two, three. Again, two. <coughs> Good. This time we're going to breathe in for four and out for four. Make sure that when you are done at the end of the counts that you have nothing left in your bellies. You should be gasping for air at the end, okay? Breathe in, two, three. Again, two, three, four. There you go. Again, two, and, and. Now this time we're gonna breathe in for two, and then out for four, all right? So one, Two. Again, two. Again, two. Good. I like that you guys are, um, you've got to hear a lot of constant. I don't see a whole lot of shoulders moving, so I think you guys are getting it down. All right, one, two, three, four, five, six. Take a balloon, pass it down. Keep your clarinet on the ground. Stretch it out a little bit so that they're easy to blow into. We're using balloons today. All right. The point of this exercise is we are going to breathe in for a certain amount of counts. I'll let you know. And then with that entire breath, you don't have a specific amount of time to do it, but pretty much as quickly as you can, blow up the balloon as big as you can, okay. all right? So in that one breath that we're going to take, so we're going to take a breath in for eight and a breath in for two, and you're just going to go, you know, one, two, three. Oh my gosh. <laughs> until, you can't, <laughs> until you can't take it in anymore, until you can't push anymore, and then you're going to look at it and be like, that's a nice balloon. And your goal is going to be to, with, we're going to start off with eight, and when we move to four, the goal is going to be to blow it up to the same size. Does that make sense? Yeah. So you're not going to tell us when to stop, you just stop. You just stop when you're out of air. All right? Cameron, you have to go. All right. Okay. <laughs> Don't do that. All right. Breathe in. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Don't breathe in again. Breathe out and hold it. We'll, we'll see who's got the... Good. Those are, 
are some good, yeah. That's about the size that I have. Good job, guys. All right, let it out. All right, let's do it again for eight and try to get the same size that you just had. That'd be great. Don't pop it. Alright. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and good job. Yeah, good, 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 good. I like those. Those are great size balloons. Alright, let's do it one more time. Let it out. Yeah. Let it out. Let it out. All right, this time we're going to breathe in for four. Now try to get your balloon as big as possible, and you're going to only have half the time. Make sure that you're not tightening up your chest. Breathe with your tummies. So breathe in. Two, three, four, go. There you go. Good, good, good. Now, while we're doing this, one thing you should notice is that, let them out. One thing you should notice is that when you blow into the balloon, you have to have an open mouth, right? You can't pinch your mouth. You can't let your balloons go. You can't pinch your mouth, otherwise you won't be able to get air into your balloon, and you won't be able to blow it up as big. And you also have to have good air support so you can get the balloon as big as possible. Let me, well, think about it. You're good. All right, let's breathe in for two and try to do it. This one's going to be hard. All right, you're going to have two counts to take as much air in as possible, and then you're going to blow it out, okay? Ready? One, two. Good, good. Awesome. Blow them out and put your balloons behind your books on your stands. Let him out, let him out, let him out. Let it out. <laughs> All right, behind your books. Okay, so pick up your clarinets. When I say concert F, do you guys know what note you're playing? Nope, no. You're playing a G. So you're going to play a G for me, and using the same, thinking about the same way that you're blowing into that balloon, blow into your clarinet with a nice open mouth. It should be open. Yeah, it should be anything. All right, so clarinet's up, and you're just going to take in, it's going to be the same thing as the balloon. You're going to breathe in for four and then out for four on that G. Okay? Ready? Breathe in, two, three, four. Good. One more time. Breathe in, two, three. Good. Breathe in for two and out for four. Breathe in, two. One more time. Breathe in, two. Good, you guys sound so much better. I really like it. Let's move on to something real quick, and it's the, the rhythm thing that we were doing on, on a Thursday, where we, we set up the big beats with our feet, and we did the little beats with our hands. Let's put your clarinet somewhere safe. Don't stand them up on the bells like that. They sit flat. Just go on, y'all. <laughs> you just figured that out. All right, put it on the ground. I don't want to it on the ground. Come on, come on, come on. All right. Let's set up the big beats. The big beats. 